how to convert Ethereum token to Binance token and Trust Wallet. Hey people, welcome to this new video. In today's tutorial, we're going to see how to convert the Ethereum uh, token into the Binance token using our Trust Wallet. So as you can see, I'm already in here. I have a few assets of my own. So what I want to do is to convert the Ethereum to uh, the Binance coin. So you want to focus where it says swap. And where it says you pay, you want to select this one and you want to select the one that says Ethereum. So what we want to get is the BMV token. So if I select this one, you're going to see that there's no asset found. And the reason of that is because there are a few tokens that are not compatible to make the swap in the application. So what you want to do is to go back where it says done. And the other way that we want to do this is to go into our browser inside Trust Wallet, as you can see it right here. I want to enter the website that says pancakeswap.finance slash swap. Now after that, as you can see, this is the swap. I'm going to go scroll down a little bit so I can connect my wallet and I'm going to select the trust wallet. So now that we select this one, we are in. And then we want to select the token that we want to make the conversion. In this case, that would be Ethereum. And I'm going to select cake so I can swap this for BNV. So. As you can see, you have to put the amount. In this case, I'm going to make this backwards so you can see what happens after I put into uh, swap. So I'm going to select swap. I'm going to select the price update. I'm going to confirm the swap. And then this one is going to send us right away into our trust wallet so we can make the confirmation of this one. It says make sure you trust the site by interacting with if you allow the site to access the fund. We make the confirmation. And this says transaction submitted. And now we can view this on a the smart chain scan if you want to, or if you're not. And we want to exit the browser and we want to go back into our wallet. And now as you can see, here are all my assets. Now just in case you don't see your assets, you have to go into manage token list. I'm going to select the ETH, in this case the Ethereum. And if this one is not enabled, you just have to click on enable and click on done. So if I clicked in here, I'm going to see now my Ethereum available. So there you have it guys, really, really simple. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more about this app. Thank you for watching the video and I'll be seeing you guys on the next one.